Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. <clears throat> Ooh. <laughs> Thanks for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, what I need for you to do right now is I need for you to give me all that fun, loving, beautiful energy that you got. You can do that by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. You can just do all those beautiful, magical, glorious things that you do to me so well here at Ty's Tarot. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> I just got done screaming at the top of my lungs, so. Yeah, I'm putting the holy water down. The uh, neighbor's cat. I love socks, right? Well, his name, I call him Socrates, because, you know, I like fancier names for cats. Well, human names, anyway. <laughs> So, Sir Socrates, he comes over every day. I love him to death, right? I also know that he's a little bit of a killer because his mom told me so. And Plus, I seen him jump on a possum the other day and try to attack it. And I was like, oh my God, I yelled at him. But today, I'm, I wake up, right? And I'm, I sit outside every morning with my coffee and I like try to get peace and quiet, right? And I listen to the birds. So, I'm hearing like what I think is a baby bird. It's like, eh, eh, eh. And it starts getting closer and more intense, and I look, and it's Socrates, and he's got a baby bunny, and I see this little mouth, and he was screaming, and I freaking suck. I mean, I mean, I screamed, Pisces. It was loud. And then he dropped the bunny, and then he went back for the bunny, and then I even got more loud. Oh my God, I got so loud. I screamed bloody murder. And I looked at him and I said, you go home right now. And I mean, it was loud, Pisces. And you guys already know that I'm loud. Can you imagine, though, like how much more loud I can get? Well, I got so loud that two of the neighbors came outside. <laughs> like, what's going on? I was like, I'm sorry. And I told them what had happened. But yeah, so I'm a little raspy right now. Oh, happy Father's Day to everybody out there. All the dads out there. Happy Father's Day. I hope you all have a beautiful day. I've done my Father's Day rounds. I uh, wish my, my best bud, Rand, happy Father's Day. And uh, my real good friend, uh, Gregory, uh, happy Father's Day. He sent me a picture of his son. It was so sweet. So, oh, happy Father's Day to all you beautiful dads out there. I just love you guys. So, Pisces, Tarot is now in session. The most honorable Judge T.T. T. Dawn presiding. You may all lay down. So, you know what we're going to do, baby. We're going to check in on the energy of the person you're dealing with or whatever energy is coming towards you, my beautiful loves. Whatever the case is, we're going to get it. We're going to hit it. And then we're going to quit that shit together. Sorry if it's loud in here today also. I have the windows open. It's getting ready to rain. And I got a fan on because I like the air. So... Sorry about the fan noise, if that's what you probably hear in the background. All right. Show! Oh, me the energy of the person. Come on. Show me the energy of the person, my beauty. Okay. All right. Yeah, six swords there. Okay. Show! We got six swords down on the table. We've got ten wands. We've got the knight of swords. The overall energy for the reading today is the hangman, Pisces. So, uh, Pisces, your person's getting some kind of clarity here on something in this situation. Six swords. Your person here is moving away from a difficult time here. And uh, basically, this person is just wanting, like, an easier time here in whatever situation I don't know what their past was or whatever here but I know it wasn't that good here um, we got ten wands here down on the table man this person carries a heavy load they carry a lot of burdens here 
But at the end of the day, this person is not quitting here. And, uh, yeah, that's what's going on here, Pisces. <laughs> Knight of Swords down here on the table. Uh, Knight of Swords is very fast-moving energy. Um, kind of reckless, too. Uh, comes in real quick. Uh, wrecks shit, you know. Wrecks it before he checks it and then leaves. <laughs> so, boy, oh boy. You know I like a good sword fight, so. Um, we're going to actually talk to those burns, though, first. I want to see the ten wands. Show us the ten wands here. Let's go. Ten wands. What's this person's burden? Ten swords. Something here that has ended here. Oh, my God. <laughs> There's something here that's ended. What's ended here for this person? Ten, ten swords. Show me the ten swords with the ten wands. Oh, my God. Their happiness. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> well, that's uh, pretty horrible there. Oh, man. Something that made them happy that was a bird. It's burning this person. Okay? This is a huge burden. Whatever is in it that used to make this person happy, uh, it's done. Okay? So, your person is not... Oh, my God, Pisces. This is no bueno. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, no. I don't even want to know what's going on here. Oh, my God. Okay. So, whatever made them happy here, in the past, it's over. <laughs> oh, shit. That's really, really sad. Okay, I don't really like that, but <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's not about what I like, it's about what is. <laughs> okay, so what's this difficult, what's the six swords? Let's go to the six swords, let's just talk. Six swords, what are they going towards now? This person's going towards something here. That wasn't good. I did say that. <laughs> it's like, oh my God. Six swords, let's go, six swords, come on. Six swords. Oh my God, Pisces, this person. <laughs> Whatever they're going towards here, it's giving them a lot of anxiety and communicating is giving this person anxiety here, Pisces, because it's like this person needs to wait for the right time here to do something. Oh my God. So why are they waiting for the right time to do something here with the seven pentacles? Top to bottom, seven pentacles. Show you the seven pentacles. Seven Pentacles to the Queen of Pentacles here. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. So it's like <laughs> they're waiting for the right time here, I feel, to it's like to have the necessities in life here. Okay? It's like they're trying to move past a difficult point in their life here. With a lot of anxiety here, okay? Whatever they're moving towards here, it's, it really gives them a lot of anxiety here. And I feel really strongly here, Pisces. I know this is a strange energy here that's on the table here, but it's just like they're waiting for the right time here for, like, growth here or monetary growth here. Something's going on here with this person's energy here. This energy is kind of, I don't, this is, this person's not, whoever this is, is not in a good state of mind, is all I can say. It's not good, Pisces. And I don't know whose energy this is. This is just a general reading. So I can't really, yeah, this is wild here. But your person is not, this is not, a, this or this energy that's coming towards you, or this energy that's deal, that you're dealing with here. It's not really, there's a lot of anxiety here. And this person is, I feel like they're incredibly depressed here. And it's like, nothing ever seems to work out for this person. Like they want it to here. And it's basically because this person has got a lot of anxiety issues to deal with. I'm going to go to the Knight of Swords. This is a wild energy. So what's this Knight of Swords and the person that Pisces is dealing with? What is this energy getting ready to do? Knight of Swords, let's go. Show me the Knight of Swords. Oh. Knight of Swords. 
Yeah. Pisces. Whatever this energy is here on the table today, um, this energy here, it's like this person blocks themselves. It's like this energy has got a huge blockage here. I'm not going to lie. This person is very blocked off. The energy here is incredibly blocked off because of this ten swords with this ten wands. This is the most wild energy that I've ever picked up here. I mean, seriously. I've never picked up an energy like this here. So it's like this person wants to come in here and do something, but basically what they end up doing is they stop, right? Because it, it's the emperor to the seven of swords here. So it, this energy here, it's like it wants to come towards you, but then it just shuts down here. This is a closed off energy, Pisces. This is really weird. I'm going to get the white sage, clear this off, and then uh, get the final messages. Because this is a weird energy. What else does this energy want to tell Pisces? I don't know what this energy is. It doesn't even seem human, which is really strange. I don't know why I'm even saying that. So I don't, this energy here, I feel, is very fickle. This energy is very fickle. This energy is very focused on loss. And what else is this energy? This energy here is always changing. Okay, Pisces, I'm sorry. This this was I'm not sorry. I just it is what it is. I read the energy. This is a blocked off energy that's approaching you. As soon as it approaches you, this could even be your own energy for all I know. You can take it as it resonates here. But it's like as soon as this energy it starts coming towards you, it just it it, it shuts down. This is the weirdest reading. So Tarot's adjourned. Woo.